the drums in room two. <laughs> I like the hammocks in room five. A little TLC can go a long way. I love all the rooms. My favorite is the library. Michelle McLean and Lynn Truitt are reading evidence of that. Notes from students at the Real Life Center in Puyallup, a school for children with behavioral challenges that prevent them from attending traditional school. Oh, it makes me so happy. They're reading the notes in Real Life's library, as colorful as a rainbow and fully stocked. This part is cool. I feel like this looks like Barnes and Noble over here. We're not able to show the students faces, but they are thankful because a week ago, their library did not look like this. This classroom wasn't even usable because the carpeting was so bad. Lynn is the principal here and can attest that, in fact, their entire school looked completely different, and it was all thanks to an army of volunteers. It's a life lesson that every kid counts. Why not? Why not come in and make the school more beautiful and give the kids a place that they can be proud of? Michelle is the leader of that small army. After teaching a class at the school for a year, she learned about how most of the funds went to the specially trained staff and not into aesthetics or extracurriculars. I heard a teacher say that these are these kids probably feel like the throwaway kids with a throwaway school. And I thought that's sort of what touched me. And I thought, I don't want any kid to feel like they don't have a good school, you know. I, I want every kid to feel like they have a library and they have a music room and they have an art room. This is incredible. Oh, boy. After months of organizing on social media and a week of work, <laughs> Michelle's <laughs> army gave Relife a new life. <laughs> including a sensory room for kids needing comfort and a creative room that has a special purpose. A young man was in here that was just banging on the drums, trying, not even worrying about the music, mm -hmm. but that energy level was just seeping out and he could do it in a creative manner mm -hmm. rather than an angry manner. And that's what's so important. The final touch, all the names of the volunteers decorate the school. They can see every day how many people care about them. It's more than some TLC. It's a way to let a group of students know how much they matter. I mean, the kids here are, are amazing kids, and they just need to know that their community loves them and, and that they're enough. In Puyallup, Vanessa Mishanya, King 5 News.